is this gonna be the first time that a random IG ad influenced me to go get some food and I actually liked it? I don't know, let's find out. I got it, let's try it and rate it one through 10. I was scrolling on IG and this place called The Coffee Class popped up and it was showing homemade Pop-Tarts. That was enough to sell me, so I went and got it. I spent about $80, but I got food for everybody. So I'm gonna just show you the food that I got for myself. A lychee green tea that the lady threw in for free because she said it was hot outside. She had no idea who I was. Her customer service was just amazing. Ooh, that's real green tea. It's strong. Personally, it just tastes like green tea to me. I don't really taste the lychee, but it is refreshing, especially because it's hot outside today. Seven out of 10. A fruit cup, it looked like just pineapples and grapes. Ooh, where'd they get them grapes from? A farmer's market? They big. I had a fruit cup at the other place and I rated it last time. I'm not gonna rate this, it's fruit. <laughs> I'ma just rate it whatever you think a pineapple and a grape is and leave it like that. A Rice crispy Pop-Tart. On their website, it said they got a strawberry shortcake Pop-Tart that I really wanted to try, but she said it was all sold out today. So I got this instead. The icing on top is a little sweet for my liking, but it's a great filling that makes that really balanced. 8.5 out of 10. Mm -hmm. A strawberry croissant. This thing looks heavenly. <laughs> Hell yeah. Bro, what is this? This is one of the best pastries I've ever had in my life. And I don't mean that lightly. 9.8 out of 10. A little bit of salt makes this a 10. One thing, it is messy though. I just turned into a powder donut. A bacon and egg strudel. You can see I'm starting to lean in my chair because I'm starting to get the itis. At first, I wasn't a huge fan of the scrambled egg because sometimes when you put scrambled eggs in pastries, they tend to get a little moist, like they make the whole pastry moist. So it kind of throws off the texture and I'm a texture person, but that bacon and a crispiness on the actual pastry itself saved it for me. Eight out of 10. Last but not least, a toasted strudel. And it's the homemade toast strudel. Like it's thick. It's filled with something. That has no choice but to be a certified for show. You're right on. Absolutely. Again, icing is a little sweet, but that feeling for me is perfectly balanced. I'm gonna give it to them. IG ain't mess on this one because it's a 9.3 out of 10. I think I gave all of them really high ratings. Rightfully so, because all of that was delicious. God bless you. Have an amazing day. Y'all be safe.